All right, this video is going to go over uh, basically a cheat sheet for what happens to equilibrium price and quantity when supply or demand changes. So I've kind of broken this down into nine different boxes. There are nine different scenarios because demand can do three things and supply can do three things. That gives us nine different scenarios you need to know. So you can use this cheat sheet to check your work. I wouldn't recommend memorizing it but you could study from it and try to learn it. So the first thing, if demand increases and supply increases, so if we begin here with our original supply and original demand, supply increases, demand increases, we end up here. And so at this case, we know that equilibrium quantity will be higher, so Q goes up, you can see that but what happens to P equilibrium price we don't know in this example it stayed the same but it could go up or down depending on the magnitudes of the shifts now what happens if demand decreases and supply increases so here's supply increasing here's demand decreasing we know that price is going to be lower but we're not too sure about quantity. So quantity is unknown and P goes down. Now what happens if demand doesn't change but supply increases? So demand is still our original demand curve. Supply increases. We're going to see equilibrium quantity increase and equilibrium price go down. All right, now let's do supply going down and demand going up. So now supply decreases, it goes down, which is an upward shift, and demand increases, meaning that it goes up or is a rightward shift. So we go from this point to this point. The change in Q is again ambiguous. We don't know if quantity goes up or down, but we do know the equilibrium price will be higher. Now what if demand decreases and supply decreases? So supply decreases, go from this line to this line, and demand decreases, we go from this line to this line, so we end up here. So we know for sure that equilibrium quantity is going to drop, but we don't quite know what's going to happen to price. It could go up, down, or stay the same. Now if supply decreases, and demand stays the same, we're on this demand curve, supply decreases, we can see equilibrium price going up and equilibrium quantity going down. Now what if supply stays the same and demand goes up? So this is our supply curve, our demand curve, we see both equilibrium quantity and price increasing supply stays the same and demand goes down we end up at this point equilibrium price and quantity both decline and what if demand stays the same and supply stays the same well we know for sure that there's no change in equilibrium quantity and no change in equilibrium price you can visit the website freeeconhelp.com to actually get this graph as well as further explanation if you want to print it out to study from or uh, have more questions about the topic.